I was telling you percussion of the chest when you examine. So how do you percuss the chest? Is I look at you so that it looks natural. You have to do an anterior percussion. Okay, the areas of anterior percussion are you do a direct percussion in the clavicle. Just, just open this button so at least the clavicle gets exposed. Okay. You do a clavicular percussion. Begin with that. Thereafter it is the anterior part of the chest, so infraclavicular. Compare with the opposite side. This is mammary and inframammary. Okay. Posteriorly you just turn this way. You stand behind the patient okay. and you do a, a, a pikal percussion. This is called a pikal percussion. So this is all be dull except for a narrow patch of resonance here. Called the chronic isthmus. Chronic isthmus connects the anterior resonance with the posterior resonance. An area of the chronic isthmus would be dull in apical lesions like apical fibrosis or in pancos tumor as you see. Okay. Then you have to do a suprascapular percussion. The finger points this way. Okay. Ideally the patient should keep his hand like this. Yes, that makes the back prominent. Scapula, then this is the scapula, this is the vertebra, so interscapula. You can make it upper interscapula, lower interscapula, and infrascapula. This way, the direction of the finger changes to this side. Okay? So that's it. This is how you focus. Now, how you interpret this science? When you are 